Well, good morning. It's actually noon o'clock, and we are at Providence Soapery 62959, and it is Thursday. Thursday is normally the day that I make soap, so I want to show you what's happening in the soapery today. These are my soap molds, and I have moved them into the soap room. This is the soap room. This is where I keep all the completed soap and all of my materials to make soap and bath spa treats and bath bombs and ingredients, okay? Today, I am not make my crock pots to make hot process soap. Today, I am not making soap. I am moving stuff around. I'm going to take you through the hallway. We had a tree fall on our carport. So all of my soapery stuff, some of it, actually it's my laundry room. Ah! Here's Josiah scaring me. <laughs> he enjoyed that. Okay, this is my laundry room. Okay, so I have a washer and dryer here. And this is the place where I normally keep the dog kennel, and that's where Lucky stays. It's his little den. He's very terrified of storms. Um, so what I am doing is I'm removing everything from this back porch laundry room playroom. Okay, which is quite a bit empty now, thank you Lord, because all of it is going to have to get ripped out. And the reason why is because that big oak tree in my backyard where we have the tree house. It fell on the carport. Okay, this was where the carport used to be. Okay. So this oak tree fell on what used to be my carport. It also fell on, and it's about a third of the tree, of this oak tree, fell forward towards us, jacked up that part of the roof, jacked up the, that, that room that you see right there with the windows, is where my bathroom is the first window, and the four windows together, that's the laundry room, playroom. So it leaks now, so all that's got to go and get fixed. So today, and then <laughs> my husband had just finished this wall, enclosed it. <laughs> it's the only thing standing. <laughs> so today we tore the rest of the, not we, I actually worked inside and Josiah Nelson is in charge of this at 14 years old. Richard has taught him what to do and how to do it. And then we had Shane Shelley come over and Gordon Geise and Haley Craft and Katie Koo and another child. And they came over, we worked inside and they all worked outside and got this done. So here is possibly some good wood that can be reused. And this is my favorite part. A dumpster we get to keep for 10 days okay so we're not making soap today <laughs> we are not making soap Josiah is here ready I think he's gonna make a loft bed but he's taking a break I think he has his, his uh, dimensions over there okay so this is what we got happening in the soapery today and I also look this is my Christmas tree my Christmas was smashed and Tabitha and Mariah came over and helped me. And Katie and I, and uh, another friend, took care of some of the stuff. But I still have this to go through. There's see oh, how my poor angel is moldy in my Christmas pillow. Some of it I can probably salvage. But I need to throw some of it away. Lucky, do you have anything to say? He doesn't. So that's what's happening in the soapery today. So if you need any soap, I recommend that you call or text or let me know 
because I am not gonna be replacing soap very fast if I don't even make it on Thursday. So that's what we got happening in the soaperies. And any soap that you buy for the next little bit is gonna to go to help the Mitchells who are going to be going to Zambia to help the McDonald's who are expecting baby Isaiah so excited so if you want to help out with that that would be a blessing all right love you